In 5000 BC, early pottery emerged in the Lilithic period in China. In 2500 BC, Egypt began producing high-quality pottery. In 1500 BC, pottery made its debut in Greek folk art. The utilization of pottery by mankind has developed over millennia. Transition from a pragmatic tool to a cultural carrier and transactional attribute within commercial social systems. Even in the context of 21st century industrialization, pottery takes on an additional value with heightened social significance. Rongxian County, a small county located in the southern part of Sichuan Province, China, produces pottery liquor jars, capturing 45% of the national pottery market share. The annual output value of pottery in the county reaches $140 million, with more than 30,000 residents actively involved in the pottery industry. The vessel for storing liquor in China, often linked to the oriental oak barrel. Pottery requires a relatively low firming temperature as air permits. The wall of the liquor pottery jar developed numerous fine holes, which facilitate the micro-oxygen circulation between the liquor and oxygen. This accelerates the exterification and oxidation reactions of the liquor and produces a mellow and fragrant taste. My name is this nickname comes from the high density, excellent breathability, robust vibration resistance, and leak free nature of liquor jars made of clay in Roshan County. According to estimates, smart devices such as intelligent kiln production line and high pressure casting promoting currently used by pottery enterprises in Rongxian County are expected to reduce enterprise energy consumption by over 20%, and the product yield rate is expected to increase from 88% to 95%. Taking Marvel, Disney, and Universal Studios as examples, the value of their products does not directly depend on the manufacturing cost of the products themselves, but on the cultural value attached to the physical objects. Therefore, even this small Chinese county with a population of only 460,000 understand this truth. Only by enhancing the cultural attributes of the products themselves can a small pottery increase profits through cultural resonance, driving this industry with an added output value of $140 million towards a higher value-added commercial stage. At present, Rongxian County has formed an industrial cluster that integrates raw material supply, pottery production, cultural and creative processing, product packaging, trade logistics, and technology research and development. In order to seize a larger market, trade logistics in the downstream of the industrial chain is also constantly being strengthened. Let's observe as the empire of the pottery intangible culture heritage industry in this small county in southern Sutra progresses towards a goal of $1 billion.